All right. Time has come. We've been waiting for this announcement for years now. So arguably, probably from the community's perspective, the best preview that we saw last night from Adepticon's live show. What am I talking about? Well, the Horus Heresy, of course. It's finally here. Here we go. So with the Horus Heresy, so much to unpack on this one. Just, just amazing. So we have a new edition of Warhammer. The Horus Heresy has just been revealed. So let's check out this video because this thing is amazeballs. Let's begin. All right. I'm going to put it all the way to silent for now just to appreciate the aesthetics and avoid any copyright concerns. Basically, we have Horace strutting in, talking about how he never wanted any of this. You know, it's not his fault that he uh, made the decision to unleash his armies across the galaxy to extract his, basically, his revenge on the Emperor for lying to him. Not narcissistic at all. No, totally, totally a normal reaction to uh, being upset with your father. <laughs> Unleash the hounds of war. Super badass, though. You know, I, I haven't been into 40K specifically too much lately. Aesthetically, of course, the lore love it, but the game itself. So I'm really looking forward to Horus Heresy as maybe maybe what gets me back into actually playing like big 40k, but technically 30k. We'll find out, but visually, if you've if you've read the Horus Heresy books, which I highly recommend, this trailer just really captures the vibe of those books. It's so cool. I like how it kind of has this uh, Alexander the Great vibe. The aesthetic, a little bit of Greek, a little bit of Egyptian kind of motifs going on kind of helps with that too. Of course, you have to know about Alexander the Great. Assuming you do, this this really has like captures the essence of that, that historical piece of history, if you will. Yeah, that trailer was amazing. Pure eye candy. You'll probably end up watching it at least a dozen times. Maybe more. Let's be honest. This cinematic conveys the scale and sheer destructiveness of the heresy's battles like never before. Completely agree. And it makes clear exactly why you should never go mano a mano with Horus. And hey, was that a new kind of tank? Really? Now, excuse us for a moment while we just watch this ship obliterate the Titan again. Yeah, yeah, that's this is this is incredible. Got some screen captures here we can appreciate again. Yeah, very cool. Very cool. So we can confirm that an incredible new edition of Warhammer, the Horus Heresy, is coming out later this year. OK, so weeks, but likely months. And we can't wait to show you more of it. As we build up to the launch, you can expect our remembrancers to bring you a closer look at exactly what makes this game so special, starting with information on the new edition's miniatures every Thursday throughout April. Right on. So every Thursday throughout next month, we'll see new previews from Horus Heresy. Very cool. Expect a spotlight on key units from Warhammer the Horus Heresy, as well as more reveals as yet unseen models. Right on. Okay, so Eagle Eye viewers may have already noticed a new logo at the end of the Kabanda reveal video at the Las Vegas Open and on the boxes for Fafnir Ron and Dominion Zephon. Now it's time to take it from Easter egg to pride of place. 
So yep, we've seen the logo, but what's the game itself going to be like? This new edition builds on the systems you know and love from your battles in the Age of Darkness. Just as before, it's based on the classic 7th edition rules for Warhammer 40k. All right. But the team have made a raft of changes and improvements to ensure that the Heresy Era battles are better than ever. All right. So we'll just have to wait and see in the coming months, but especially throughout the month of April. Again, every Thursday in the month of April, we'll see new miniature reveals, which is super cool. But what do you think? Are you excited for this Horus Heresy? I, again, I, I am. I am curious to see what we all get shown here in the coming months. But again, I'd like to get your comments below and get your feedback. What are you most excited for? Are you concerned about the rule changes or are you excited for some, you know, minor rule tweaks? All right. Well, as always, if you haven't yet, please consider subscribing to the channel. Hit that notification bell. It really helps with the growth of the channel and it's greatly appreciated. And with that said, I hope everyone is doing well today. Be safe, take care, and I'll see you all again soon. Bye-bye.